Now I'm going to show you how to decorate a window using Christmas ornaments. What you'll want to do is you'll want to get some simple lightweight ornaments and some different holiday ribbon. You're going to feed the ribbon through the ornament, tie a knot to keep it in place, and you can either just cut the excess off or for my treatment I'm going to tie the rest into a really simple bow. And since they're nice lightweight ornaments, I don't have to worry about the bow untying itself. Pull it nice and tight. So this is what you're going to want to do. You're going to want to make a whole bunch of these, however many you'll need to cover your window treatment. All right, we're going to start with this one window and we're going to start in the middle and work our way out. So what I'm going to do is you might want to leave a nice long ribbon until you decide how long you want it. You can always cut off, cut off the extra. So I've got my ornament on the ribbon and I'm going to get just any type of tack or push pin. And I'm going to decide how long I want the ornament to hang down. And then take my push pin or my tack and push it into the wood surrounding the window or I can push it directly into the wall, whatever you prefer. This is a nice way to do it because then it hides any holes that are created by the push pin. So I've put that one in the middle. Now I've got two different color ones. I chose a little wider color. I'm going to put those on either side. Now I want to make sure that they're not at the same level to create some interest. So I'm going to start with one, leave some space, and you see I'm going to kind of bring it down a little bit and put my push pin in. And I'm going to do the one directly beside it, working my way out. I want to make sure that this one gets the same distance apart and the same height. All right, and then the last ones I'm going to do. You can do different things to create a pattern. I'm just going to try to create a nice V, make sure that this one and the last one are not on the same level. But you can bring it down really far to create a V, or we can bring it up a little bit to make them go up and down. That way I can go all the way across the window and create a nice zigzag pattern. Make sure that you plan ahead so that you don't end up with more ornaments on one side of the window than the other. You want to keep things balanced. So now we have created a nice visually appealing decoration for a window. Thank you and have fun.